Hey, it's JC1424 once again with NASCAR Heats Ultimate Edition. Plus, and in this episode of our season as Ryan Blaney and his number 12 Menards Ford, we're going to Martinsville Speedway for the Martinsville Speedway night race. I don't think it's supposed to be called that though. Last episode, we dominated Bristol, but it was nuts. Wackiest race of the season yet. And Chase Elliott won that because I decided to experiment with some camera angles and I couldn't handle it because I, yeah. I have a full race lead over everyone, starting with Truex, because of my dominance in the stages. Stupid stages. It's, it, won't, it won't split in half. Ah. Pizza time. Ryan Blaney is supposed to be standing there. And there. And stays in the car. Ah. Okay. That's enough pizza time for now. Mm. All right. Um, practice is uh, canceled. No, no practice. I'm chewing my pizza. Mm. And my my why are my default setups stupid tight? What asshole made this game? Okay. I have never driven around Martinsville at night on this game. Oh my god, the car is stupid tight. This is my second time trying to qualify, and Jesus, it's tight as shit. If I try to throttle it off the corner, I will spin the car. There's that. There we go. That's a good corner. It won't turn. Okay, about half a second off the pole time. At a short track. 14th. I started 13th at Bristol. So I can work with that. I don't think I'm going to win this race. David Reagan starting 15th. David Reagan raced last weekend at the uh, thingy race. The, the Daytona. The season finale, or regular season finale. I don't, whatever. It's my season finale. I don't care about any of the stuff that comes after it. Uh, Stenhouse is up here. Bubba Wallace up here again. De Benedetto with top 10 runs. He didn't have top 10 runs until like the second half of 2021. It was a bullshit game. Keslowski and Christopher Bell in the front row. That is intriguing. That is unusual. We're still 14th. So let's get through there. Okay, okay, so it's a little sunsetty. Cole Custer is a snowflake. Accurate. <laughs> I, I don't think that changes anything about his performance. He's just going to run even more last place ish. And then they said something about Kyle Bush and blah, blah, blah. I don't care. We'll figure it out as we go. I didn't see any of Kyle Bush last video. I don't think I saw him one time. That was a janky ish start. And we're on the outside, which is unfortunate. Okay, a little tight. In turn one. Put off a two. We're getting a little run. Oh, we're three wide. Freaking Stenhouse never clear Harvick. Ugh, oh, keep it off the wall. I'm trying to pass Stenhouse. I was supposed to pass both of those guys. Or, I mean, at least I thought I was supposed to. We're going to get the run off, and we're going to pass Harvick now. We're still going to be on the outside. Dude, what is this? Is this NASCAR PSP? I'm over here passing them on the outside at a short track. Like, you can't do this in any other game. But I'm doing it right now. The joke is, if you play NASCAR PSP, then you know, on the hardest difficulty at pretty much every track, you can pass them anywhere. Except, of course, at, like, a super speedway. You know, that's EA Sports logic, of course. But, goddamn... Feeling like NASCAR PSP again. I can just pass them wherever I want to. Oh boy! It is one tight car. I can't do things with this car. I mean, I am. But I have to put up with the car, and I, I don't like it. I don't like having to put up with this car to get shit done. It's so tight. And maybe I should have put on like a slightly looser setup. I don't feel like that would solve the issue. But uh, we cleared Harvick. I have smashed them brakes so freaking hard, and I still missed the corner. It don't mean shit. I hate it when it don't mean shit. Wait, so 
It's 31 lap stage here at Martinsville. It was 30 laps in the stages at Bristol. This track takes like five seconds more to get around. Oh my God, what race is this that we're doing right now? Got a big old traffic jam up there throughout the top 10. I figure I could be a part of that and do some stuff, make up some spots, have some racing. Oh, there we go. That's a great exit to the corner. So we're doing the first stage in Sunset. Stage two should be the night racing stuff. Oh my God, Carter. You say I haven't raced that night at Martinsville in this game. Didn't I do that like in the truck series? Or maybe it was the Xfinity series. I, I think I did it in the Xfinity series. So maybe that was just a load of crap. But I was just like left with the impression whenever I got here that I had never raced here at night yet for some reason. I mean, I, I thought I didn't. I'm, I think I'm just stupid. I'm stupid. I keep on trying to make passes on the outside. It is a boat! Oh my god, the boat has returned. The wonky do. Yikes. It's doing that thing where one tire comes off the ground, then the other tire comes off the ground. That might be slightly possible at Martinsville, but still, it shouldn't be as likely as what we're seeing on this NASCAR heat game. This isn't a road course, but it has the potential to drive like a road course. Ugh. Don't forget what happens if you touch the curb in the middle of the corner. Oh my god, this is terrifying. And Alex Bowman is passing me. Because this car is tight and loose. It's loose off and extremely tight in. Okay. Now I'm trying to race him. On the outside. That that doesn't work. Now I gotta deal with Chase Elliott. I don't wanna deal with Chase Elliott. I wanna deal with Alex Bowman. As stupid as that sounds. I hate that in order to pass somebody, I have to go to the inside and miss the corner. <laughs> That, that's just the way the car drives. I, I've been dealing with that off of every freaking corner, and if I just get in the throttle and go, that's what it does. I did not pass either of the people I was trying to pass. Uh, the front of the field is starting to catch lap traffic, so like none of this has served any purpose. If we go to the, the leaders and the lap cars, we just drive right around them. It won't stop doing that! Ugh. Dude, I had a fine corner. Normal, regular corner. You still doing it. Help. Comment section, help. What is it? I don't, I don't know what it is. We're not on loose setup. I'm tight as fuck, but I'm loose off the corners. Oh! In order to pass cars, I have to just miss the corner. I mean, it doesn't feel like I ever make the corner whenever I actually hit the brakes where I, I should be hitting it. Like, the brakes just stop working unless I come in from the outside, and then I get that arc. I'm already on the outside. See, like, their brakes work better than mine? I don't know, because I hit the brakes, and they weren't even slowing down yet, and then suddenly we're all slowing down, but my car is not slowing down. I, I don't understand this game. I don't understand these cars. I want to pass the, the lap cars and make up spots, but how? How do I do that? How? How do you do that? How? How do you not hit the cars? How do you slow it down? How do you... Fuck, man. I don't... Ow! Stop! Stopping! Go! Drive fast! Fuck! Dude, this sucks. This sucks. I'd, I'd rather be driving NASCAR 21 Ignition short tracks. God damn it. They, they just keep stopping, and my car won't stop like that. I don't want to stop like that. And then whenever I'm... I'm... I'm ah! Jesus! Go! Damn it! I don't get it. I don't, I don't get it. Whatever, whenever... I, I am not battling how much they're stopping in front of me into the corner. I'm tied into the owl. I'm tied into the corner. And then I come off the corner and I'm sideways, damn near flipping over the car like a boat. Stupid Brandon Gun. Stupid Brandon Gun. Damn it. I'm trying to go around him. I I can't gyrate the turn. Yeah. I can't shake that booty off the corner and, and get it on and get it done with. I it's I'm just tight until I'm loose. And the traffic is now annoying. It's more annoying than it was at Bristol. At Bristol, it was actually kind of fun. But this, they're slowing us down. I quit turning uh, a couple days ago. Jesus, car. What are you doing, McLeod? McLeod. Okay. I'm having a hard uh, fought battle here 
with B.J. McLeod in the 78. And the lap cars are trying to pass me. I, I, I hate after, I gotta turn right. I have to turn right, stupid. I have to turn right off the corners and smash it into a wall damn near. I feel like I'm gonna do it wrong one time. I'm gonna hit the outside wall. Move, move. Oh my God, Cody Ware. I hope you get fucking baited in by a really hot anime titty girl and then she fucking slaps the shit out of you. Corey LaJoy just destroyed the front end of my car. And he we destroyed the back of my car. You're blaming all this shit on me. Somehow that's only three seconds of damage. Jeez. Man, I parked it. I smashed them brakes. There was no stopping that. Everybody's pitting. Okay. I, I guess I'm pitting too. Fix the damage. Yeah, sure. Good. Just do all that. I only lost four spots. Still better than where I started. I, I started 14th. So we're like two rows higher up now, I guess. Alright then. Uh, I'm trying to hold this outside line just right. Car is back in pristine condition. Condition. So I should be able to make all the moves and, and get that adequate handling in the car that I need. Uh, it, it won't turn at the beginning of the corner. So uh, now I got Bowman to my inside. Uh, try and pass Larson. Okay, there we go. Uh, got a big run on the high side. I am going to... See, I hit the brakes early and pull in front of him, but he can just make the corner, and I cannot... Hitting Hamlin. I just want to pass Bowman. I'll get the runoff off the corner. And then I'll hit the fucking wall. Fuck you! Fuck you, car! Fuck you, Bowman! Fuck your AI! Fuck them going into the corner and hitting the brakes way later, because I just saw it right there, and then his car just stopped. And mine just kept going forward. Slid to the outside. Fuck you! Fuck you, game. I don't need no tires. And we'll fill the tank. With half a can of fuel. I, I gained seven spots. Yay, great. I'm happy about that. It makes me... It makes me smile. Fuck you. Fuck you, game. Fuck this Martinsville. It's blue now. Add the filter, JC. Make it stop being so blue. Stupid freaking dumb filter they put on. You know, it gets nighttime. I hate the nighttime filter in this game. Why is the car so retarded? Can someone please, please tell me, like... What changed? Like, I I just cannot. It's like heat evolution levels of stupid now. Ugh. Like, it's tight as fuck. And it's, it's loose as shit off the corners. And the racing experience is annoying. I wanted to pass Hamlin there. I have to break so early. And I don't like it. I want to hit the brakes when they hit the brakes. See, I, I saw them hit the brakes. They're, like, a couple car lengths ahead of me. So whenever they hit the brakes, then I hit the brakes right after that. That hasn't been working for the majority of this race. Ugh. I just want this race to be over with. I don't, I don't like this race. I don't, I don't like it. Maybe if I start at the back of the field, I'd be happier. Because... Then I'd just be passing slow guys constantly. But even that seems to be very bad whenever we're racing for the lead and lap cars are in our way. Okay. Got a good entry. I gotta tap that steering off the corner. I'm trying to learn it. I'm trying to figure out what the fuck the feeling of the car is because I've done run an entire stage in this race. I feel like we've gone through two stages. But no, we've only done one. Caution. Hamlin has spun. Ah! He, he kept it off the wall. He kept it clean. Kept it good. Okay, now wait a second. 
How was Hamlin 7th? The caution came out and Hamlin was in front of me. What? What? Dude. I don't know. He has lost the car completely. He has removed himself from the race. Why? Oof! Jesus. <laughs> he just spun around a little bit and then suddenly he's gone. I don't know. It's not a freaking, you know, next gen car where you like, you, you break the transaxle just spinning the car out. You know, we don't, we don't have that with this car. So he just spun out and then suddenly quit the race. All right, well, I'm up to fourth. I am blocking Christopher Bell. And I am trying to pass Kyle Larson. And that I will do. Like, I already made the corner as it was going in there. He's got damage to his front end. Who did that? Did I do that? I, I don't know who did that. Oh my god! That's what I'm talking about. Every time I try passing somebody, then someone else comes in and they pass me instead. Now I have to put up with Christopher Bell. Now there's a fucking caution. I I just lost track position. Fuck a restart. This is making me sweat. It's making me pissed. I hate. Mm -hmm. Why two guys at the front of the field just went to the back? I don't even know why. I don't know what that was. I don't get it. We got ten laps to go at the restart, and I I am fuck this. I don't want to race this freaking track again. I have to race this track again. These stupid freaking playoffs. Man, I should just never even put the freaking playoffs in the schedule. Would you stop driving like that, you dumb fuck car? Oh. I guess I'll be racing Kozlowski. I'm trying to make the corner from the outside. I can't. I can get loose, though. I can get loose, though. Ugh. Hold the inside. When I send it in on the inside, you don't have to go up the fucking track. Now you can go up the track. Now you can make the corner. Barely. I hate it. St I am turning right. I am turning a lot of to the right. Fuck you, Truex. Suck your own cock, Truex. Fuck this whole entire, entire experience. Fuck it. I hate it. I cannot handle this fucking car in traffic. The worst part is whenever I can't get out of traffic because cars won't stop trying to pass me. Every time they do, the car just falls apart and it doesn't do anything that I ask because there's someone in the way of the optimal racing line. Oh, I, I, don't, I don't fucking like racing this fucking track. I don't like this freaking stupid cup car at this track. It wasn't like this in the other series. <sighs> yeah. Get all the tires, all the fuel. There's no damage. I... I had to maneuver around people coming to the end of that stage, but I didn't bash it up. Now, I'm in traffic again. God, I hate stage racing. Why do, why do we even have it? I mean, how they award the points for it, all that should make sense. But, dude... Fuck this, it's just killing me here. The freaking stage racing has me deal with traffic for like an entire two minutes, three minutes. Now I got Truex on my inside. It'd be nice if I could just pass Tyler Reddick and then everyone could just fuck off. Okay. Rotate. I'm trying to counter steer constantly out the freaking corner. Hmm. To prevent it from getting loose. One of them front tires always comes off the ground and then suddenly I have to jerk the car all over the goddamn place. It's like you, you don't get the car quite on the lane that you want to into the corner and then suddenly someone sticks their nose in there and then you're in this, this giant loophole of cars racing you and messing up your corner. 
Well, we're in lap traffic, and I am trying to focus. And here we go again. They're going to park it in front of me every fucking corner. And I have nowhere to go. If I go to the outside, they park it in front of me. If I go to the inside, they park it in front of me. Ugh. I literally need an entire football field worth of space so that I don't crash into someone's rear end. Ugh. Now you got Cody Ware. We're over here downshifting because of Cody Ware. Chase Elliott is the leader. And we are taking the lead. I don't feel like I'm the fastest guy on the track. I mean, I'm okay. We're just fifth place speed. This car is stupidly unstable. G Jesus Christ, this car is just a fucking animal. God, I hate it. It's so annoying to drive. Ugh. Yay for good racing, right? Yay for good racing. Oh my god. They, they just parked in front of me. Well, the fan favorite son lost the lead because of Brendan Gone. What? Retire. Retire, Brendan Gone. Why are you running full time in the Cup Series? Why? This is not NASCAR 06. Alright, well, Christopher Bell's gotten away for the time being. I mean, he's never been faster than me. We both kind of run the same speeds. Chase Briscoe is holding up Christopher Bell. And there's Chase Elliott. We are going around these guys on the outside, and we don't have a choice. We're not going to make the pass for the lead here again. Ugh! I'm hitting Christopher Bell because he is smashing the brakes. I don't even know why. Okay, here we go. We gotta run off. Ugh! Try to stop the car in a turn one. There we go. Back to the lead. And there's a big old pack of lap traffic right up there. It took a very long time, but we finally found Kyle Busch. I never saw him last race, and I don't think I've seen him in this race until this moment right here, where he is running 25th. I mean, I think this is 25th. If I could pass to Benedetto and put the stupid thing on the screen. Yeah, he's running 25th. Why? Why is Kyle Busch running 25th in Martinsville? I mean, it's not Bristol, but I mean, come on, it's Martinsville. You're not Kevin Harvick. Uh, we'll squeeze through here on the inside and miss the corner trying to make the pass. Uh, okay, okay. You, you want to move up to 24th. I feel you. Uh, it whipped to the inside. I, I have to turn the car. And it's either you turn all the way or you don't turn. And sometimes I'd just rather turn the car. What is that? I got loose in the straightaway, trying to find somewhere to, to be for the time being. There's nowhere to be. There's nowhere to be. I have nowhere to go. I have to fucking linger, loop de doop de da the fucking car all over the goddamn track because I can't just use the horsepower that I have. I have nothing to do with these fucking horses. This poor Mustang is just stuck in a stable in the straightaway. <laughs> it's a stable on wheels. Even more lap cars. I see Cody Ware again. That's a bad sign. We have caught the tail of the tail of the field. <laughs> oh, no. Uh, 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 uh. Okay. We're doing it. Lapping up 22nd. There's 21st. 19th, 20th. Uh, I'm trying to overdrive the corner to avoid hitting cars. Can someone please explain to me why Eric Almarola is advocating for me to eat my girlfriend? Anyways, I'm trying to drive around the lap cars. The freaking automatic transmission keeps floating into second gear because I'm stuck. It's Cody Ware's fault. There's Kurt Busch. Probably not even running that bad. I mean, he's well, probably 15th. I don't know. I've lost all track of where I am in the field because a bunch of these guys are falling two laps down right now. My fuel light is on. And I, the car will not stop getting loose. I'm going to head down pit road. Oh my god. I sped on pit road. Because they didn't tell me what the speed limit was until it was too late. They do not tell you what the speed limit is until it's too late. Now there's a caution. Austin Dillon blew up during pit stops. That's why the caution came out. Oh, Jesus McLeod.
All right, that's what I'm going to do. I'm not going to get any tires. I'm getting enough fuel to make it to the end of the race. Yeah, so yeah, William Byron just got a free pass. You see, I don't think that I'm going to have good tires this restart and all that like I need to. The thing is that they never get tires as late in the race. I feel like it's really late in the race. Yeah, it is. We have freaking 16 laps to go. This car was already driving pretty bad on the worn tires. That is such a weird scenario. But I've seen it before at the same time. Oh, hello, Ross Justine. Ugh. Yeah, they're trying to find their way around me. I'm in traffic. The car does not like traffic. I'm trying to get around Ross Justine. I cannot break into a corner like they can. You can see me and Chase Elliott on the brakes about the same time I miss it, he doesn't. That's been the problem all freaking race. He's 11th. I'm the lead. What? Man, I'm stupid. All right, here you go. Keep it nice and good for Powers call the caution. And another caution. I think what's happening is cars that are on the lead lap can't pass me because lap cars keep getting in the way. And these lap cars are the faster guys that are supposed to be up front. David Reagan's in the top 10. Ryan Priest is in the top 10. Nothing else is really all that abnormal. No, I'm not pitting. We are going to skip even more laps. I don't know, there should be like six or seven laps to go now. Yeah, Joey Logano got the free pass. I knew that was going to happen. Okay, Christopher Bell is for position. He's been second the entire time. For a while, it was... Ross Chastain. Who just Chastain to me? Go figure. Oh my goodness. See, now that these guys are out in front of me, that kind of makes it difficult for me to actually win this race. Because I'm not really even that fast. I'm faster than Chastain. But Christopher Bell, we've been like neck and neck with him all race, and he probably got tires. I'm going to work on him. Sometimes it's not in the cars, but in NASCAR, it's just not in the fucking tires. But it was in the tires. I was fucking cranking it back to the right off of turn two over and over and over again. <sighs> it took me a couple laps to get in the zone after that little jump cut there. And I just... <sighs> Fuck. I mean, I don't feel like I deserve to win this race anyways. Cruiser Bobel won a stage. So he was up on all race long. I just didn't notice. Um, David Reagan did get a top 10. And, um, Joey Logano, yeah, he won the other stage. So, I think we had quite a few DNFs. I know Denny Hamlin, Noss, and Dillon were some of them. Yeah, they're, there they are. Then there's Cole Custer, six laps down. Maybe he DNF because the next guy is four laps down. But, I mean, he sucks. I don't think it makes a difference. And here are the points after that race. I think I lost points on my lead. But either way, it's still a one-race lead. At the very least. Oh, great. I'll see you guys next weekend. When we go to Richmond, where life sucks, and even if I use a custom setup, I cannot get the car to do what I want. That has been the trend with Richmond on this game. Nom, 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 pizza. Nom, 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 pizza. And also next week, we're going to Talladega for the Gecko 500. Okay, see you next time. That's that, and episode over.